So that first floor is finished, completely done. All the woods there and the temporary boards are down. So the next job is to start cutting the I-beams of the floor above out. In theory, it should be easy. I've got the lifter in the middle supporting the weight. I'm just going to cut either end and lower it down nice and gently. Unlike other times where I nearly pulled myself off the edge trying to take them out, this should go a lot smoother. Slide it down the steps and go around the back of the port lift. Yeah, okay. Just slide down the steps. So you can see normally what we would have done in the past was clear out all these pockets, chisel them and start putting the wooden beams in. But the new way we're going to do it is putting a C section of steel onto the wall so it's in each end and bolted to the wall and then all the beams will slot into that. It stops them having to go into the wall and chance of rotting and it makes everything a lot slicker, a lot more level, just a lot better overall. So let's get this first C-section in, in the floor above.
Last steel to go up for this floor. Oh, finally. Let's try to get his tree down. <laughs> What's that, John? It's been a long time coming, did not it? Yeah. Yeah, that tree's done a lot better. Paint on that wall would be right. Yeah. Whew. Even just now, being at this level is weird, isn't it? Yes. Last time I was at this level, I was just there. In a tree. Oh, I was up to that beam. I was on that beam. Cool. Finally, I can walk from the landing to, well, nearly directly to the balcony. It's a little bit of a detour until we get the other bit of the floor in, but I just couldn't wait. I just wanted to be up here on this level. It's amazing what else you see. As soon as you're up there, even though we've been looking up, it's amazing what else you start to see up here. The condition of the walls is so much better on this side than definitely than the other side. Also, like here, we can see that there's two kind of supports, which on the other side, they use that to support a fireplace. And maybe there's two chimneys behind this wall. I'm just having this long view now, all the way from one side of the chateau to the other. So tomorrow, we're going to get the second third of this floor in. We've got a bit of messing about with the other C section, which we just got up. Levels are a bit off, so we've got to spend a bit of time that. And then we're going to start on this floor. Well, providing all the steel comes in time. So I'll see you in a couple of days.